One week from tonight, the Weber State football team kicks off the season at home against Western Oregon. The Wildcats had a down season last year, and they're looking to get back to the playoffs this year. After making the FCS playoffs five straight years, Weber State went six and five last year and was left out of the postseason party. But that has fueled the team all through training camp. Now, last year was kind of a it was a tough year with the spring season, fall season, and. We left some things out there, and we're just excited to kind of have a fresh start. As weird as last year was and uh, maybe not reaching the pinnacle of what we thought that team could have been, uh, I do see a fire in these guys. I see a close-knit bond that they want to get back to winning ways. Weber State is ranked 20th in the preseason poll, and with six Big Sky teams ranked, it's going to be another tough grind. But with Josh Davis back running the ball and quarterback Bronson Barron behind center, the Wildcats' offense could be dynamic. It's just the more games you play, the more comfortable you get, you know, especially at the quarterback position as you get more experience, you're getting more of an opportunity to, to see more defenses, different looks. And so, just like you said, the, the maturity, I feel like I'm getting to where I want to be. Rashid Shaheed, one of the greatest receivers in school history, is gone. But Ty McPherson is back, hoping to stretch the field for the Wildcats. Rashid's a tough loss. I mean, Rashid's as good as they come. It was cool to play alongside him for a couple years, learn from him. And now we just pick up the slack and get those young guys rolling. The reality is it's going to be how we handle adversity, how we handle success as we come into this thing, how we overcome injuries that will occur. Uh, that's going to be the, the telltale sign as to whether we're ready to win another championship.